Hi, everyone. Hello. Um, so today we're down at Sandown Park uh, in Eastshire. Uh, this is kind of like our first carting of the year. Uh, we have obviously we've been stuck due oh, to the COVID the restrictions and all that kind of jazz. Um, so today we're kind of preparing for a 24 hour race later this month. Uh, we wish that lockdown ended ages ago so we can get plenty of practice. Yeah, right now we're literally just taking a walk down the track. Um, just looking at the conditions. It's very windy today. We had a little bit of a storm yesterday. Uh, we were just disgusting because um, the wind direction is blowing this direction towards corner. Um, we're expecting around turn one, which is this bend up here. We, we can probably feel a tug coming along here, but we see how it goes. The rain has just gone past by. Uh, the dark clouds right here, it says it's expecting a rain at roughly about seven o'clock. Our session is roughly about, about half past six. Um, sorry if you can't hear me due to the wind. Can't deal with that, sorry. But it is what it is. We'll, uh, we'll see how the wind Trying to speak as loud as I can so you guys can hear me. But yeah, no, looking at the track conditions today, it does look a little bit damp. It has been raining in that last night. Um, but it's been quite fairly dry all day today. Um, yeah, we'll just see how, how it is later. Um, give it a go. We are driving a Sony Cuts today. Uh, we wish we could do the D-Max, but hey, uh, we're low on money. <laughs> so it is what it is. But um, yeah, looking forward to the session. What do you think? Yeah, it's been good. I'm a little bit worried about the cold because it is getting chillier as the night goes on. I've got new gloves, so hopefully they'll be warmer. Um, but that's another reason why we're here. That's something uh, we're gonna have to get used to because in 24 hours it's gonna be night time. It's yeah, gonna... like trying trying out some brand new gear as well. We we all got like brand new boots, gloves. Um, a lot of people have cameras now. Um, neck braces and all that kind of stuff, isn't it? So. So yeah, a lot, lot of it today is just testing out gear. Uh, we wanted to go and test our headsets today, didn't we? Uh, yeah. I'm an idiot for a bring, not bringing this bracket where the um, the receiver sits it on works. your helmet. But it does work, we tried it out. Um, we probably have to try and book another session later in the month if we can try and squeeze one in. And then... Uh, we can spare the cash for some D-Max. Yeah, <laughs> hopefully try and get on the D-Max and stuff because that's what we'll be driving for the 24 hour race. So. Yeah, we'll see how it goes today. We are meeting up with a friend named Ashley. Um, I don't know where we met him before. I we know, I don't think we met him before. Uh, but the the group that we mainly go uh, kind with and that, a lot of them are working at the moment. Uh, and plus, it's kind of like I say, last minute thing today. It was kind of like it's kind of like, like. Oh, well, I'm going down to Sandown tomorrow. He's like, do you want to come with me? I wake up this morning thinking. Yeah, you just uh, like we're just waking up this morning looking at messages like, yeah, okay, we'll come down. <laughs> so, Class. see how it goes. So a little bit of a weather update. Sun's out, which is really, really nice. Uh, there is a, a big, massive black cloud in front. If I turn the camera, it's just right there. Um, so we're hoping that we'll just go past pie. Had a lovely opportunity just to go up here and we watched these two drivers go out and they were just uh, driving around the track, probably had a little feel of the carts and stuff before we probably go on them yeah no it's looking really good they seem they've got a bit of grip around these corners and stuff they seem to like flooring it around turn one and that so it's all looking good yeah looking forward to go on okay so for for those people who haven't been to uh, sandown park in isha um so due to the recovered restrictions there's some rules that have been taking place since i last been here uh, previously you could just park up go inside the the building and then you sign yourself in and that you can literally get yourself food drinks and you can wait around inside the building or outside in the waiting area and then you get to get to see the good views of the pit and all that kind of stuff but a little bit has been changed now so for those who's coming down during the the covid restrictions so when you come down on this uh, main road right here there's a gentleman there'll be security right here who will ask you if you have seen a safety video when you book online um that's up to you be truthful say if you have or, or you haven't um so if you have you simply just park up in this car park over here give a wave connor and uh literally wait until 
Uh, you get called or wait until your session time. Our session time is at half past six. Uh, you will have to go down this path right here in between these two hedges and then you'll sign in and then that's it, you're ready to go. So we're about to go in and so for a little bit of an update on the weather. Got a lot of rain coming, so uh, we're just about to go ahead inside and check in and uh, get our gear and all that together and then uh, get some practice in. So here we go.
Okay, so what do you guys think? Oh, that's solid, 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 solid practice. Yeah. Um, so to start with you, Ash, uh, what's your pros and cons out of that session, even though it was Sodis? Uh, if I'm brutally honest, um, no real cons, just <laughs> a bit of practice just to get back into the game again. Oh, yeah. It wasn't perfect, nowhere near, but uh, it was just a this was just to help build consistency going around that way. It's so. just getting into the actual car as well because it's been such a while yeah. since we've been in one so yeah. it's just kind of like refreshing our memory. Oh actually no there yeah, is a one that I'm incredibly unfit. Oh yeah um, I do. <laughs> I'm the same with that. Normally so. my left knee plays out when uh, when I go around and like an hour's worth of racing but 20 minutes in and I was already mm. fucked so it was um, life changing. Yeah. <laughs> what about you Connor? Generally, it felt, like, it felt pretty solid, and I felt like um, pace was better than the last time I was here. But uh, I felt if I was one too scared of the curbs, I avoided them like the play because they're bumpy, and you're not supposed to do them. Mm. That's what everyone else is using. I was like, well, no longer I'm losing time on everyone else. Everyone else is using the curbs. So yeah, I've, right. I've noticed on um, was it uh, on the final corner just before the main straight, the yeah, curb on there is a bit of a killer. Yeah, I've noticed I've reduced a lot of time during that. Curb. There's times that I have took it way too wide, mm. uh, yeah, mainly because to to avoid someone who was taken on the inside. Yeah, uh, there was one. I started using it later on, and then the magic. There was a guy I was about the red ball out of the ground, um, right. and I got past him using like I got use a curb, get past him, got past him, good good exit down the straight, and I was uh, past him. And yeah, completely got clear from the rest of the race because he was holding me up quite a bit. Um, fairly similar pace, but I was just a bit faster. So like, Please get off. But what about you? What are your pros and cons? Uh, well, the cons is what the seats are rib protector and all that kind of stuff. More setup, yeah. isn't it? But when it comes to um, uh, like pace and stuff, I did slow down a lot. Uh, about 10 15 minutes in and I really don't want to do that next time yeah. I think that's mainly because I was getting pains in my hands yeah. um, I couldn't grip the wheel properly and uh, there was times where I just had to let go probably stretch them out and stuff yeah but um, yeah. other than that I'm so glad I had a battle because <laughs> I really wanted to do it, like team sport is nothing it's quite easy to overtake people in team sport and stuff but when it comes to a really fast pace and that um, I'm glad I had that battle. I, I tried to learn as much uh, racing line as possible. There's a few stuff that I did try to go a little bit wider or narrower and stuff like that, but that's part of practice, isn't yeah, it? I mean, realistically, but do you guys want to know your lap times? That's what I, I say go one. Yes, what we're about to say next. So, with myself, I'm 50.8. 50.8? 50 50.8, 50 yeah. Nice. Which is a lot better than I was hoping it would be. Okay. <laughs> so, I'm happy with that. Um, for yourself, you had uh, 51.8. 51.8, yeah. okay. Uh, lit up, it was just under a second. Okay. Um, and then for yourself, you had 52.1. Right, right. let's shoot. Yeah. I've got to get home, have food, and then get to bed. Yes. So, good to meet you and that. Yeah, and um, yeah, I'll definitely catch you soon. We'll have a chat about the next session. So. Next time. Oh, I'm We're always chatting every day. So. That's it. <laughs> right, cool, yes. safe travels, mate. You guys take, take care. Bye-bye. Yeah. All right, I literally just got home. Um, what what a session. Loved it. It was really good to go and see Connor and Ashley. Um, I haven't met Ashley. It was good to meet you. And I'm really looking forward to doing a 24-hour race with you as well. Um, it's the same to you, Connor, as well. Out of everything uh, that, I, that happened today was perfect, exactly what I wanted. I uh, had a few battles. Had a few miscalculations, trying to save the cart and stuff. There's times that I have really pushed it. Some of it is like a little bit to an extent where the back end was about to um, kick out. But other than that, um, for everyone who's watched this video, thank you for watching till the end. Uh, please give it a like. Um, stick a comment down below. Um, and if you really like to go and see some future content, now, don't forget to subscribe. Take it easy. Bye-bye.